So historically, diffuse large B-cell lymphoma was treated across the board with ARTRA. And with ARTRA, about 50% of patients will be cured, but the remaining will relapse. And as a result, we really need to dig further into the heterogeneity of the disease. I think the initial stage of understanding this heterogeneity came in the form of gene expression profiling, identifying two distinct subtypes, namely germinal center and ABC subtype. And germinal center clearly had a better outcome versus ABC subtype. Multiple clinical studies demonstrating um, no success with addition of targeting agents to our trap versus our trap alone. I think there are many issues with those clinical studies, especially the diagnosis to treatment interval, which was very long for those patients, and thus it may have enriched for patients with only a good biology with diffuse large B-cell lymphoma. Nonetheless, I think a bigger advance came in the form of the Polaric study, which uh, treated in a randomized fashion stage 3, stage 4 IPI2 diffuse large B-cell lymphoma patients and randomized them to either polar art chip or art chop alone. And I think the net is that um, the primary endpoint was met. There was a 7% improvement in progression-free survival in favor of our chip polar. The toxicity profile is absolutely comparable to our chop, and thus the FDA now has approved our chip polar in patients with stage 3, 4 diffuse large B-cell lymphoma with an IPI of 2 or abo above. But we do know that I think the unmet need continues to exist because we also know that diffuse large B-cell lymphoma is just not divided into germinal center and ABC. We now know of molecular cross clustering subtypes C1 through C5 or the MCD um, um, N1 subtypes. Uh, based on that, I think what we need to really determine is which uh, signaling pathway do these subtypes target and maybe the next generation of clinical trials that may improve our understanding and our ability to cure all diffuse large B-cell lymphomas is really targeting these pathways with respective targeted inhibitors in the form of of a clinical trial based on the subtype that the patient harbors.